this video, we want to see how we can use Camel Query on lookup fields. If you start by reviewing the sample list that I've created to show you the demos, then we will query the lookup field by values. Next step, we query the lookup fields by key. And finally, we have a demo to show all these things in action. The sample list that I created is called products. This products list has a field called title and each title has one or a couple of categories. So the category is a lookup field from another list called categories. To query the lookup fields by value, I just write my camel query exactly the same way that I was writing it for text. So where equals field ref and I put a field name which is category and the value, the only difference is that now the type is lookup instead of text and I put the exact value that I'm looking for. To query the lookup field by key, there's exactly the same way that I was querying the values. So the where statements, the comparison, which is equals in this example, field reference is going to be category, which is a field name. The only thing that I add extra is going to be the lookup ID set to true which is actually telling the query engine that the value that I provide here is the value of the lookup key in my list. Let's see it in action. To show you this example, I've already developed a custom web part here that inside this text box, I can write the query and when I click the execute, it runs the query against this list. So let's start by our first example, which is querying the category field by value. To make it easier, I just go back to my Visual Studio XML editor and I start writing my camel query. The where statement equals field ref name equals category and value. Type equals lookup and it's going to be, for example, electronics. Copy and I paste it here and if I click on execute, it should show me any item that is in electronics. One, two and three. All these three items are listed here. Now let's query it by the ID instead of the actual value. To do this, I just come back here to my query and I add another attribute called lookup ID equals true. And instead of the lookup value, I just put number two, which is the ID for the entertainment. Copy and I just paste it here, click on execute and it's going to show me only we which is the entertainment. Of course if I want to try another item for example for health items, health the ID for health is 4 so if I change this to to four and I click on execute again, it's going to show me anything that is categorized under health. That was it. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned, subscribe, and more videos are on the way.